We will now look at the charting for the web trading platform. Here we have the GBP USD. This is the one hour candlestick chart. So in this chart, each candlestick represents one hour. Both the type of chart as well as the time frame can be changed. The time frame can be set from five seconds to one month. This designates how much time each candlestick represents. So a one month chart would actually show a few years of data. There are a variety of chart styles that you can choose from on the web trading platform. Many traders will stick with candles, but some types of analysis use other chart styles. You can also add technical indicators to your charts. Clicking on the tab allows you to choose from almost 70 different indicators. Here is the list of indicators that you can scroll through. We will scroll down and choose Relative Strength Index, commonly referred to as the RSI. That will add the RSI to the bottom of the chart with default values. Here we have added the RSI indicator to the bottom of the chart. By default, this is a 14-period RSI. We will see how to change this in the customization video. You can also remove the indicator by clicking on the X. With advanced charting, we can add a wide variety of tools to our charts. Starting with the most basic, we can draw support or trend lines. Here we can click on the line tool and draw a horizontal line connecting the lows from the earlier period and then the highs from the right hand side of the chart. The line is support until it is clearly broken and then, as can happen, it becomes a level of resistance. Here we have added a more advanced drawing with a channel. With this chart, we can see that the AUDUSD was trading within this channel for almost six months on this daily chart. You can also find Fibonacci tools on the relevant button on the left column. We will next look at setting up and customizing your trading platform.